so this is the display so far but still yet we can see that if we click on them there's nothing practically happens this is due to the fact we haven't initialized we haven't instructed these buttons what to do after being clicked so this is the next thing that we need to do right over here let's head back to the text editor and here we will be now defining all these buttons so in the first place the first id was roll back up another thing we have made this typical mistake i'm sorry guys uh, remove all those hashtags from here press ctrl s in the first place this is the id here now we'll be creating the first button on being clicked which should be performing some definite actions and we need to define the definite id right over here so the button with an id of rollback up actually any element which has this id of rollback up eventually which is assigned to this first button on being clicked it is supposed to do some desired jobs right over here so it should be i guess we have missed this one dot ui dot shape and what is it su supposed to do it should pick up the element now if we press ctrl s and if we head back to our project and reload and now if we click over here we can see that the cube practically rolls up and all the sides are shown right into our page now if we are done up to this for we have to do the same thing for this next buttons those we had created right over here first of all let's copy this thing six more times i'm sorry five more times and in the same manner we need to change these ids from here so in the second case we will be using this id of roll back down mentioning that on clicking this particular element which has an id of roll back down it will be performing the shape of flip down there it goes similar thing happens here for this one this is the rollback left id so let's change it there it goes next comes the rollback right from here this is the rollback right next comes the roll back flip right next comes the roll back flip left and we need to change all those things over here like for this left one we need to mention flip left for this roll back right we need to mention it as flip right next it comes as flip over so press ctrl s and let's reload now we can see that for this first button on clicking this first button it practically rolls up next it rolls down next comes this roll side from left from right next comes this flipping over so everything is done right over here and in the last case it is practically doing something but we haven't instructed it to do anything at least so we need to check it back and for the time being we won't be doing anything else right over here just leave, leave it up to this far press ctrl s reload 
and we can see that the last button stays inactive it has something to do something exceptional so in the first place we are practically able to do something some flipping shapes into our project and we can see that all these sites those are practically being uh, displayed to us into our web browser